I found myself waking up in a wasteland. The sun burning on my skin. The sand reaching for my feet. I have no recollection of how I got here. Why I got here. When I got here. All I knew was that if I did not walk, I would dry out and die of starvation. I was hoping to find someone, anyone. I wanted to phone so I could call my wife, call 911. I needed to know if she was home, if she was all right. Hell, I needed to know if I was all right. I kept on walking, endlessly, until my eyes saw something in the distance. Clouds came soaring through the sky. I felt a cold breeze, but at the same time I was boiling like hell. I started to mistrust my sense of temperature, but yet, I started to mistrust my sense of reality. I walked up on a long and dreadful hill, and the sight of what I saw next still rattles me today. Sheep, hundreds of sheep rushing across the land, marching through the desert. I can still feel the earth trembling beneath my feet when I think about it. The meaning of it all, I still haven't got a clue. The more questions I raised, the less answers I got. All I knew was that I had to keep on walking. I had to find some water fast before it was too late. Again, it seemed as if my wishes were granted. I stumbled upon a bottle of water. But like last time, the granting of my wish felt like a cruel joke being played on me. The water looked disgusting. The color was dark. It was filled with sand and dirt. A dog wouldn't even try this if his life depended on it. But hell, at this state, I would have drunk down the devil's piss. As I took a sip, I was wondering if there was much difference anyway. Who knows? Maybe I am in hell. It sure feels that way. Without my wife. Without my family. I drank down the bottle and rested my head. As the sun died.
the heat must have gotten to me. It felt as if my mind had been fried, and my legs could no longer carry the weight of my own body. As I fell down on my knees, I felt the sun burning, cutting through my skin. And that cursed sun. My body was tired. A grievous pain tormented my insides, burning like the sand and the sky and the air in my mouth. I was out of energy. I was out of water. I was out of faith. I heard a splash of water as I threw away the empty bottle. The sound of seagulls surrounded me, and I swear I could start to smell the ocean. As far as I knew, hallucination could only be experienced through the eyes. But the sand felt cold and liquid. Maybe I am hallucinating this. But what if I hallucinated this whole desert? What if I was on a raft floating across the sea? I washed my face. For a moment, I felt hope. Only for it to be taken away from me once again. I was out of hope. I was out of energy. I was out of life. I was out of words. <laughs>